Mehdi Amiri has a unique ability to empathize with his patients and appreciates the challenges they experience with their health. He is a dedicated pharmacist who not only displays a healing presence while a patient is in the hospital, but he maintains that presence and foresight to ensure that the patient safely transitions back home to their community. His resourcefulness and caring nature makes a difference for his patients. For this and many other reasons, Mehdi is the recipient of the Values in Action Award for Compassion. Compassion for me is, comes from the basic teaching that I learned throughout my upbringing. As like Jesus did, he taught and he healed with great compassion to whom he served. And I try to do the same, that mimic the same value that he had to heal and help other people with compassion and especially the people that are in need. Maddie's one of those people, employees, co-worker, friend, who's always there for you if you need someone. If you can't do what you do, he's willing to hop in and help you. If you need help getting off work because your child is sick, he's right there with you as well. He always cares about the person, the patient, the co-worker, the nurse, the doctor. It's, he's not just doing a job, he loves his job. And he loves what he does and you can tell. He's a um, truly compassionate clinician. So we work as a pharmacist, we need to follow up on certain cases. And uh, Mary was the one who was always willing to follow up compassionately. And uh, I think that there's uh, many occasions that patients themselves, you know, uh, show their appreciation to, to Mary because he was so compassionate and he go extra mile, you know, to, to get things done as a pharmacist. I um, try to stay focused of why am I here and what's my main goal is, which is trying to help others and try to impact, have some impacts in their uh, daily, daily, uh, everyday daily needs, uh, their healthcare needs, their pay, uh, medication needs, their advices. Uh, so staying focused of what am I here for and try to do my best, giving, giving my 100% effort to deliver that. That's uh, what I uh, think that gets me through day by day. He always makes you feel calm. When you're working with him, he calms you down, he just helps you even things out and focus on what our jobs are, and that's to help get stuff to the patient, get stuff for our nurses, our doctors, get the orders in correctly, get the medication out correctly in a timely fashion, and he just, he's got a calming effect which I think really helps everyone just work well together. So back in January, when we were uh, running um, with our IV room um, being, having the issues and our IV room being down, everything was being really, was being really crunched. Everything was pressed for time. So, you know, it was really crunch time. Medi just took it in stride. He just said, hey, you know, something we have to do. We'll get through it, you know, kind of took everything really calm. So it really calmed my nerves down as well. You know, I was like, I felt like I was really pressed for time. And with Mehdi there, he was just like, you know what? Don't worry about it. You will get through it. Just just take it one one minute at a time. And, and just that approach and his, deme his calm demeanor was something that really put me at ease knowing that, okay, well, we are going to get through with this. It's, it's not... You know, it is an urgent item, but it, we are going to get through it. it. So let's just take our time and get it done right the first time. The way I see it is uh, we're here for a common goal of uh, serving our community and our patients uh, and healing not just their medication needs or their health needs, also their minds and well-being. So by understanding what they come from, where they come from, what they need, uh, if we try to provide our services with great health and listen carefully of what they need, it helps us to bring an excellent, optimum uh, healthcare service to our patients and to our community. He's been a really kind of a can-do kind of guy. He's always, you know, anything that we needed, he's always asking, coming around to the technicians, hey, is there anything you need? Do you need me to check anything? Uh, do you need me to send this up for you? Just always willing to help is is a big thing, especially for us technicians, because sometimes we run uh, a little busy just because we're doing so much at a time, and he's always willing to step aside once he's done with his work to come and help out the technician. So a great team player is what I could say about him. 
I think kindness is the most is one of the most important things in our lives. Um, not in our just job, uh, not it's just in daily daily life and their encounters. Uh, uh, it's just like um, how we say music is the soul for yourself. It's just kindness, doing the kind things, and remembering that b by being kind to someone, the same thing will come back to you. And this is a very powerful healing process by being kind to someone else. And it doesn't have to be just at work, it could be anywhere, at your family, your friends, your community, your work. By being kind and remembering that you're a kind person, uh, that's how I like to be remembered.